today I almost had a meltdown because I could not figure out how to charge my camera. Something had happened where the port that I'm supposed to plug into totally got ruined. So I can still charge my camera. I have to rig it up a little bit. So eventually I'm going to have to replace this thing, which sucks because I've only had it for two years and I didn't buy a protection plan on it, which is dumb. So buy a protection plan on your electronics, especially if you can get accidental coverage covered. I don't know how I accidentally broke the charging port. I have no idea how that happened, but anyway, that's my life right now. But I um, just got my wine crate shipment in the mail, which you guys know I love wine. And I am excited to unbox this for you because there's some good stuff in here and I'm going to tell you a little bit more about Wink, so that's going to count as some of Vlogmas for today, so, you know, <laughs> Vlogmas trying to get away with all the tricks I can. Okay, so obviously not the nicest setup ever, but I am going to tell you guys about the company Wink. Um, this is my lovely giant wine crate that... I get in the mail every month. We actually stopped because of Harvey because we wanted to save a little bit of money. Um, and we stopped it for like two months or whatever. So I haven't had it since since then. I guess since like August is the last time I got my last shipment. But I'm going to open this as I tell you about it. And Wink is basically like a wine trunk club. So you get... It's actually pretty cool because you either get your own four choices of wine. Um... Or you can let them surprise you, and that's probably not the safest way to open it. And the surprise is kind of the best part because they choose wines for you that fit your profile. You take this quiz in the beginning, you tell them what kinds of flavors and what your palate's like, and um, you know you can choose for yourself. But I really like the surprise element because they choose wines for me that I wouldn't necessarily choose for myself, which is always good because I never want to get out of my comfort zone. I am always the person that is willing to stick within their tiny little circle of what they know and I will not, I won't move out of that comfort zone until somebody pushes me out of it. And so granted, you're not getting very pushed out of your comfort zone by drinking wine, but it does help you to try out new things that you may not pick out yourself. And you know, I'm very visual, so sometimes I like to pick things out by just the label, not even the taste or anything. Um, and that can be good, but it's not always the best. So um, they sent, oh, this is cute. Um, there's this thing called Carnivore Club that they had sent in this box. This My first box, I didn't get something like this, but this is awesome. Um, you can get it for $39. It's regularly $55, and you get 30% off of your first box with the code WINK. Um, and Carnivore Club just looks like handcrafted artisan um, meats that you could use for like charcuterie and stuff like that. the other thing is that they send like such cute little things so this is like a little thank you note from them it says how every holiday thanks for making us a part of it cheers wink um so you get cute little stuff in the box like that. whoa i opened that slightly too quickly <laughs> um my other wink box and this one doesn't look like it it does, but my other box came with like a little magazine, and I think maybe that's like quarterly. Um, came with a little magazine that told you the wines that you were drinking, told you how to taste them, what to eat them with, how to chill them, things like that. So it's like a little guide to how to drink your wine in the best way. Um, but I got four bottles of wine. Um, I'm going to line them up, but you're not going to be able to see them, so maybe I'm not going to line them up. So. My bottles were from Wonderful Wine Co. It's a 2016 white wine blend from California. I think most of these are from Wink's Winery. Um, so a lot of them are blends and from California. Uh, my second one is called Loves Me Not. It's a rosé. Um, so it's wine from the central coast of California. It has rosé blossoms with notes of strawberry, raspberry, and watermelon candy. Um, it's rosy blush and is a little bit lemony, um, so it's a little citrusy. And whew, they're so cold because I guess it's been it's been freezing outside. So it's really funny because they're almost like pre-chilled. The next one is a Cabernet Sauvignon. 
It is a 2016 California Cabernet, so it's called Chop Shop. Um, this one's really cool. It's superior grade cab with bold juiciness, rich flavor, and fine texture. So this is really good with like steak um, or like really good prime cuts of meat. And then last but not least in my box, um, so like I said, Wink is really good because they can push you out of your comfort zone and they will give you the ability to let them choose some of your wines. So you can either let them choose all of them in the box, two of them in the box. I got three that I thought were good, which were the three that I just showed you. And then I had one of them chosen for me. And so this one is called Ye Ye. Um, it's a 2013 Monastrel. Um, and so it reflects the excitement for the modern era of Spanish winemaking. This Monastrel, an intense, bold grape of Spanish origin, comes from the southeast part of the country and exhibits soft tannins and spice along with notes of blackberry. So I feel like this would be really great with a, like a very rich chocolatey dessert. Um, it might also pair really well with some red meat, so like a good steak, like that other red wine. Um, I think it would it would go really well with something that's already very rich and has like a strong flavor. Um, so this one was called Ye Ye. Something else that I love a lot about Wink Wines is that they have a huge focus on sustainability. So um, you know they're not using a ton of the papers that you normally find at the tops of wines when you have them corked. Um, they're, they always try and sustainably resource their wines. So they pick sustainable wines, but they also make sure that the process is sustainable. So if being green and eco-conscious is something that you're into, um, that's something that this company thinks about, which is really cool. So that's some of my favorite things about Wink. One last thing is that they have a really, really cool iPhone app. I just had to get up and go get my phone because I remembered that they have this really cool app. And so what you can do is you can log in, you can manage your orders, manage your wine choices from the app. You can go in and rate the wines that you decide to taste. So it's a really great way to just learn more about wine in general, um, to try different wines that you may not be able to find at the store, and to just, you know, expect a wine shipment in the mail like I, every time I know that this thing is coming I get so excited I am like waiting for days checking my tracking making sure that I'm around or that somebody at my apartment office is around um, to to sign for the package so that I can get it that day so every time it comes in the mail I'm so excited it's so much fun just to get some wine every month um, and just to try some new things so if you like wine and you like subscription boxes and you love getting things in the mail then wink is one of those really great things to try um you you know you won't regret it if you love all of those things it'll really excite you to get your wine shipments so i'm going to leave my wink code down below so that you guys can shop for a discount at wink this video is not sponsored i really just like this company and i love what they do and i love wine so i Felt like I wanted to talk about it, and it's Vlogmas, so, you know, Vlogmas, giving you gifts, Mila's favorite things, whatever. So, there you go, the gift of a discount on wine. You can check it in the description box down below. See you later.